What is up, all my dorks, nerds, geeks, and gamers? It's your host, Ghost here, and uh, it's been a while since we had a new uh, Borderlands type game announced. The last one was announced was uh, Borderlands Three. Um, we've been getting DLC for Borderlands Three since then, uh, but it's been a while since we've had a new Gearbox style IP in the works. Uh, but now we have one, and it is Tiny Tina's Wonderlands. It is a spinoff of Borderlands, uh, where Tiny, Tiny Tina is getting her own set of games. Uh, so it's very, very cool idea, very cool concept. Let's hop right in the trailer, see what we can see, and talk about it. Here we go. What do you got, Gearbox? Prepare. Dragon. Okay. Who doesn't love Tiny Tina? Why wouldn't you want a spinoff of Tiny Tina? Wait. Especially her uh, fantasy style world she lives in in her head. Zombies. And it's all in the Borderlands art style, which makes it even more beautiful. You cannot hide from fate. Very awesome design, man. I'll, I'm so ready. And I think it's going to blur the lines of uh, what's real, what's not, because it's a whole part of uh, Tina's character. And the other thing that's amazing is the cast. The voice cast is like all celebrities. It's amazing how Gearbox did this. Very nice. Tina coming in on her uh, unicorn there. Butt stallion. Nice. Very cool. And it does look like a first-person shooter, because he was building a gun there, and he was turning around and shooting it. So maybe it will play a lot like Borderlands. Very awesome. I'm excited. Tiny Tina's Wonderlands. Very cool. Coming early 2022. That was a trailer, guys. Let's talk about it. So that was Tiny Tina's Wonderlands. Uh, like I said, uh, very awesome looking trailer. Very uh, Taking the Borderlands elements, sh slapping them into a, uh, a fa uh, fantasy style game. We got this with Tiny Tina's Dragon's Keep and the original Borderlands 2 DLC. Uh, to see them continue this into a full game itself, very excited. Definitely looking forward to this one. Uh, just super hyped for this one. Like more than some of the other E3 games they've shown. Uh, Gearbox, I love Borderlands 3. I've loved the DLC so far. Uh, so keep it up with this one. Hopefully it turns out good. Let me know down below what you guys think of Tiny Tina's Wonderlands. Are you excited for it or not? Let me know some of the stuff you expect to see in that game down below as well. Uh, make sure you like, subscribe, and share. And as always, keep it right here on Dorkston. I've been your host, Ghost. Adios, guys.